Uh, I'm just going to show you a quick and easy way on how to add the bibliography into your essay. So I'm on Google Docs. I've got a little sample that's been written already for this World War One essay. So what I'm going to do is rather than going to a website and trying to use something like that, I am going to use a add-on that's available to everyone and it's in Google Docs. So if you go up here, you're going to click on add-ons. You're going to go get add-ons. Now you're going to see there's all these different ones here and I'm going to type in easy bib, just press enter. I'm going to see here there's going to be easy bib. So I'm going to click on that. I'm going to click install, continue. Now it's going to ask me to log in. So I'll just click on my education account. I'm going to click allow. And that's it. So that's now installed. I can click done. I can close this. And now what I can actually do is, is click back onto add-ons and it's come up here, easy bib bibliography creator. I'm going to click manage bibliography. Now you can do this on any of your assessments, as long as you're using Google Docs. Now you're going to see here on the right hand side, I've got a book, a journal article or a website. Now, if I want a website, for example, I can click website. Now I've been looking up some causes of World War One. I. I might have alliances. Maybe I don't want that. I might want, uh, let's go militarism. Okay, here we go. This is the website I want. So same website, Alpha History, they've got some really good stuff. Militarism as a cause, lots of information on here. I'm gonna click up to the URL and I'm just gonna copy that. And then I'm gonna go back to my essay. And then I've clicked on website and I'm just gonna paste the URL in. So then I'm gonna be able to go search. Now it's come up, militarism as a cause of World War One. Select, and that's gonna add that into my bibliography. Now you can actually see I've already got one there for alliances as well. Now one other thing that you can do is choose the style. Now these will just basically make your bibliography look a bit different. You've got APA, MLA, I'm just gonna use Chicago. Just make sure, one, if you choose one, just be consistent with it. And then once I've finished writing my essay and I've put in my 10 entries because you need 10 entries. I'm just going to click add bibliography. And what this should do is add it to the end of your document. Now you could have more writing here. It will automatically end up, add it to the end. And now here I've got my two entries. Okay. And that should about cover it. If you do have any questions, uh, flick me an email or, uh, that's it. Thanks, guys. Have a good day.